Well, hello, welcome to Izzy's Tarot. Thank you for coming to my channel. You could have been anywhere and you came to my channel for that. I am extremely grateful. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you, universe, for sending people to my channel. I am doing a Cancer February mid-month reading. A Cancer February mid-month reading. Um, this is a mid-month love reading for Cancer. It is a general reading. It is for Cancer Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign. It may not be your particular reading. It may not hit your story. Please re look at another reader. Perhaps they have a different storyline for you. Please possibly read your moon sign or, you know, um, your rising sign. Perhaps they have your story. But this will hit some people. Um, thank you so much, like I said, for coming to my channel. If you could take the time, please, and to um, give me a like as well as subscribe to my channel. More than anything, if you could just take the time to subscribe to my channel, it would be greatly appreciated. I thank you. I'm going to give you just a few moments. All you have to do is just hit the little lady. She's down there in the corner. Just hit the little lady. You won't be disappointed. I promise you I'll always give you um, readings um, uh, intuitively through the cards. Um, and lightning will help you on your love journey. Um, so if you could just take a moment. Just please subscribe. I thank you so much for your subscription. It means a lot. Thank you so much from my heart space. Let's see, Cancers, my lovely Cancers. Let's see what's going on. Spirit guys, show me what's going on with Cancer. Show me what's going on with Cancer. Thank you, Spirit guys. Show me what's going on with my lovely Cancers in their love life. Show me. Thank you, Ancestors. Let's see, Cancer, what's going on with you? You've got Ten of Swords. You've got Six of Pentacles. You've got Strength. You've got Nine of Swords. And you've got star. Whatever you were in, you're out of it now. <laughs> Sorry, I don't want to be so blunt, but I don't know how else to say that. Whatever situation you were in, you are out of it now. That ten of swords means it is done, it's complete, it's finite, it's finished. You um, are trying desperately to get your balance back, Cancer. You are trying to get your balance back with a situation or something that you were in. You are trying to get back balance with the situation. Um, then you have the strength. Strength means that you um, are resilient. You have courage. You're trying to um, just get back on point. Um, it has been a, a very rocky road, but you are trying desperately to get back, trying to tame your life again, trying to tame whatever you have left, trying to come in from heartache, from uh, going through some things. And then you still have the Nine of Swords. The Nine of Swords means this could also be, this could be a Leo person. And this could also be an Aquarius person with a star, but you have the Nine of Swords. And the Nine of Swords means that you're still up all night thinking about this situation. Uh, someone has got you up still all night thinking about this situation. You have not let it go yet. You've got to let it go, Cancer. Um, this obviously situation, the universe would only brings you goodness, and this was not a good situation. If you let this situation go, there is hope. The star, as I said, is an Aquarius card. If you let the situation go, and when I say when you decide to not be up all night, when you decide not to have angst in your in your life about this situation. You have the star, and the star is a beautiful card. The star is hope. You have great hope for um, this, for having a different type of life than what you've had here. You have great hope here, right here. Cancer, let it go. Let it go, Cancer. Let it go. Let's see. Let me clarify these cards just to make sure that I'm telling you the correct story. Let this situation go, though. So let's see. Show me, Spirit Guys. Why is this Ten of Swords here? There was you. Uh, there was a ten of cups. The ten of swords is there because you did at one time have a great emotional um, clarity with them, great uh, emotional goodness with them. But it came to an end, Cancer, and I'm so, so so sorry. But there's a reason why things end. But it came to an end. But you started off very good, but then you have a ten of swords. So whatever started out, it did not um, complete. Um, so let's see. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? You have the Prince of Pentacles. Um, what is this with money? It's something with money. Um, a Prince of Pentacles, you're trying to get your balance back with your money. Did you give too much to this situation, to this person? 
perhaps you gave too much to this situation because six of pentacles means balance but then you have the prince of pentacles which is a money manifestation card the beginning of money manifestation um and you're trying to get your balance back you're trying to get your balance back i don't know maybe like i said you gave too much uh, maybe this person was draining you so let's see why the strength card is here show me why the strength card is here well thank you universe thank you so much you got the strength card again you are trying to get everything back in balance like i said if this was a money situation you gave too much here you are trying to tame this situation you're trying to get your money back right you're trying to get your heart back right you're trying to get everything back right you are trying to be have courage have resilience you are trying to get back on one accord with this in you not with this other person but this is with you with your energy with your spirit see because you still have the nine of swords here so show me you're trying though and you're going to get back and like i said this could have been a leo person as well but let's see cancer let's see why is this nine of swords here why is this nine of swords here you have ace of cups now ace of cups is unconditional love you're still trying cancer ace of cups is a beautiful card and you are trying to give them um ace of cups you are still up on like trying to give them that unconditional love and i don't think it's working though i really really because you have the nine of swords here you are still trying to pr provide them with a, a, the beginning of a great love you're trying to start all over again and i'm sorry i just don't see it working for this situation ace of cups um is uh, unconditional love agape love god like love you are trying to give them that unconditional love but this person is not i don't think this is the person for you so let's see let's see why this star card is here let's see because so you still have nine of swords there that nine of swords you're trying but it's not working so let's see let's see why the star is here nine of pentacles and nine of pentacles means independence um it means um moving on it means having your own money having your own life if you can stop doing this nine of swords and i know it's easier said than done but if you can stop keep give, trying to give them unconditional love you can give them unconditional love you can forgive them and, and and but you need to move on there is great hope for you if you move on nine of pentacles is money and i said it was something over here with money at the beginning the nine of pentacles means independence with your money so you have great hope and great spirit with your money and with another situation or just with life in general if you can get out of this nine of of, of swords a spirit this nine of sports swords energy with them you know cancers tend to linger on and on and on and on and on and this situation is not good for you it's not it's not it's not helping you it's okay to give them that unconditional love but give it to them from afar because you have great things here you have hope you have hope here with the star and you have the nine of pentacles which means independence your money's on point um you're comfortable you're moving in life the way you should be this situation is not a situation that you need to be in and cancer you really really need to let it go this mid-february